Hi, uh, that was a uh, good idea, a suggestion on Discord. So please keep giving us suggestions how to improve Arc Linux. And one of them was, look Eric, you have um, great bash RC with a lot of aliases in here. Lots of things to make our life easier, less frustrating. But we have of course our own personal aliases. And each time we make a new uh, skull, a new copy paste, then we get our own personal things to get overwritten. If we think about it, we have to add to it, copy paste to the bash RC, and then everything is fine. Well, there is a solution to that. There is a solution to that. We have now a new bash RC that is still in the pipeline. You see, it's red down here, that's PAMAC, waiting for it to update, but we are going to update the old fashioned way. Like this, update. Update is going to get all the Arch Linux stuff from our personal repos. This, this is us. And the rest is coming from Arch Linux. So both of them will be now installed. And if you see a line in here somewhere, it's going to install something to the scale. You know you have to type scale. And that's an alias. You can always check out aliases. We tend to forget about them. And we go to the scale and you see, okay, scale is actually copy pasting everything from the etc scale to my home directory. Great. This means that the new bash RC is in here and that's the one we provide you. That's the new one always, the latest one. The thing we've done in many videos already is compare these two, right? And say, okay, what's the difference between these two? The only thing you uh, have to do is click my right mouse click it and choose for compare our melt application goes on and the one we have here so the left is the old one well actually the one that's been used this is the one that's been used by the system and this is what we give us a suggestion okay this is the newest one the latest one and this in here is interesting Create a file called .bash RC personal and put all your personal aliases in there. They will not be overwritten by Scal. So we will not provide a file bash RC personal, meaning it will never be overwritten by our packages. But you need to create a file to be able to use it. So we'll do just that, but let's first fix uh, our bash RC. So the thing to the right needs to go to the left. And we save this, but maybe we could, can also do a combination. It's optional, but I like to do it anyway. It's Control A, Control C. So the files are the same. I could copy paste it from left or right, doesn't matter. And I save this bash RC. That's one thing. So these two guys are now the same. But when I type scale, what happens? All the information from the etc scale. Come on, follow my mouse. Will be copy pasted over. Bash RC. This is the old one without the added lines. They are not here. So Control A, delete. Control V, and the special lines are in here. And now we save. So next time I type scale, this Bash RC will be overriding the Bash RC I have now simple as that okay now in order for this bash rc let's make it bigger bash rc personal in order for this to kick in i need to make one so next thing is make a file easiest way to make a file is ctrl c ctrl v then you have a copy of the file bash rc personal no typos allowed rename go inside in the content delete everything and tell to the system or to yourself collection of personal aliases and what i've done already on my system is say when i type update i do typos update update is actually update all right, and when I'm really typing fast, I type update. 
is really a bit. And so you can make more and more aliases. In this case, it's just to have uh, the fix for a typo, but you can have your own um, aliases and commands and put them all in there. This thing will never be overwritten. Bash RC personal. Okay? Now, in order to let this kick in, anyway, on VirtualBox is logout login. That's the best way to do. Just logout login. Sourcing should work on your SSD. It works here. But in VirtualBox, for some reason, it does not like it. So, when the system reboots, it's going to check, hey, where's my bash RC? It's going to open it. And at this point in time, I have a bash RC slash bash RC slash personal. There is a personal content as well. It's paid and update, right? So let's put them here. And when I just type update, of course, everything will just be fine. But I was fast and I did this thing and it works as well. And you paid was a mistake as well, but they will function. So this will probably be fun to do, to catch all my typos so I can, uh, well, update in this case. But you can do much more and that's up to you. You put your aliases in there, they will be safe from our overrides, from our scale and you can have fun. All right, enjoy.